Okay, so now we want to create the fluid region, which represents uh, all of the air in the geometry. So a region is sort of the the region of fluid. So uh, if you can remember, uh, so imagine like all of the air taking its form. Um, then that's what the region is. If you take the analogy of a tea of a say a a teapot, the the region would be the model of what it looks like inside of that teapot, if you can imagine. So that's what we're creating now. So let's um, select all our parts, and then we'll right click and press uh, assign parts to region. So we want only one region for all the parts. Now we want a boundary for each part surface. So do you remember when we re relabel the truck into its parts? It's going to make a new boundary for each of those surfaces. And then the uh, the rest of the the setting should be okay. So press apply and close. Okay. Now when we open up the regions tab over here, now you can see we've got a region here. So what I'll do um, if I hide all this stuff, so I can either right click and press hide, okay, or I can also go into scene plot here and go into geometry which is all the stuff that's showing and then I can put uh, hide all of those or better yet I'll just deselect them from the menu so now you can see they're not selected and we can do the same with the outline edit that so deselect that and nothing should be showing so now if we uh, show only our region let's see what that looks like so it looks just the same. Now when we make it transparent, hopefully, yeah, we can see all of our uh, relevant geometry there. So uh, it's in there. So that represents the, the air volume uh, within the flow, within the simulation, sorry. Okay. So we've created our region now. And here it is. And you can see all the boundaries that we've uh, defined. Okay, truck model, all this stuff, all this good stuff. And uh, oh, where's my inlet and outlet? Did I forget to define it? Let's check. Ah, oh, yeah, I forgot to. Sorry, I forgot to de define the inlet and outlet. So let's go ahead and delete this. Uh, reset the inlet and outlet so delete the region then in the wind tunnel I need to re right click this and press split by patch again and I'll rename these surfaces inlet create then outlet so yeah sorry it hasn't been a perfect tutorial but at least I hope that you know while I make mistakes of my own I'm showing you how you can correct your own mistakes so inlet outlet then default okay and um, now let's redo that. So select it all, uh, assign parts to regions, one region for all parts, boundary for each part surface, okay, apply. So now when we look at our region, uh, we also have the um, inlet and the outlet. So that's important because later on we need to change that into a velocity inlet. Um, okay, so that's good for this tutorial. I'll see you in the next uh, video. Sorry, this video. See you in the next video.